wild things you're doing at night Trips to wherever feels right Doing it all just to feel things Drinking's enough of a vice Drugs just aren't suiting you right You were just fine as a real thing, thing. You, you, you know That's not the way to get over me I don't know what you say Here's a really short tutorial for how I play Don't Matter To Me by Drake. You need to know three chords, E flat major seventh, G minor seventh, and B flat major seventh. To play an E flat major seventh, put your pointer finger on the sixth fret of the fifth string, your ring finger on the eighth fret of the fourth string, your middle finger on the seventh fret of the third string, and your pinky on the 8th fret of the 2nd string. To play a G minor 7th, bar from the 5th string down on the 10th fret, put your ring finger on the 12th fret of the 4th string, and put your middle finger on the 11th fret of the 2nd string. To play a B flat major 7th, it's the same shape as the E-flat major 7th, starting on the 13th fret. So those are the three chords you need to know for the entire song. Now the next thing is when to play each chord. In the verse, I'm only strumming each chord once, so it should sound like this. Wild things you do in that night Trips to wherever feels right Doing it all just to feel things Drinking's enough of a vice Drugs just aren't suiting you right You were just fine as a real thing, thing. So that's the first verse Into the pre-chorus Same chords but I am strumming differently, so here's the strumming pattern. You, you, you know That's not the way to get over me I don't know what you say So that's down, down, up, up, down, down. It should sound like this. You, you, you know That's not the way to get over me I don't know what you say From here it goes right into the pre-chorus, where I go back to strumming each chord once. All of a sudden you say, you don't want me no more. All of a sudden you say that I close the... Now I'm building it up to get into the chorus. Don't, it don't matter to me. So that's when I go back to the strumming pattern that I used in the pre-chorus. Down, down, up, up, down, down. It don't matter to me. It don't matter to me what you say. It don't matter to me. It don't matter to me what you say. So in the second verse, all I'm doing is playing the same chords. I'm still using the same strumming pattern, but this time I'm using palm muting to bring it down a little bit. So it should sound like this. I can't recover from our last conversation. You call me weak, you tested my manhood as we yelled at each other. You wanted me to go and put my hands on you just to show you I love you. So that's the whole song. It's really, it's a very, I don't know how to say it, it's a hard song because of the lyrics. So the, the phrasing in this song is very important and it's very different from a lot of other songs. And that's why 
I had a, a tough time getting it right, and I think once you have the guitar part and the vocal separate, and then can bring them both together, that's the best way you're going to learn this song. Um, if you're a beginner, make sure you know these chords really well. Because if, if you're having a tough time switching to these chords, you're going to get really frustrated. Yeah, so just practice each chord. I'll also leave a link to each chord um, shape in the description so you can look at where to place your fingers even though I told you where to play them. Sometimes people learn better when they can see it, so check the description for that. And uh, if you haven't seen my cover of this song, please check it out. Thanks for watching, I hope this helped, and uh, hope you have a great day.